everybody, welcome back. This is Nilnar, and we're once again in Red Dead Redemption. And we're playing a little a little poker here. We're going to do a, another up, hand here, see if we? we can take some people out. Enjoy a, a little time here. I'm calling. Oh, five, queen and three. Get back to our hand, and if we look there, and look at the cards, I got a jack and queen. Go ahead and raise it. You scared or something? I want to scare a few of them out here. Come all the way back around to my hand, and look at the table. It's two fives, a three. So I really don't have anything yet. I've got four diamonds so i could potentially get one more diamond and have a diamond call let's let's keep going with the high bet here count me in oh he's got a good hand so do we call that 40 yes we will there we go we got two pair what you look at that i like some change but not too much change we're gonna all in it. All in for me. Fours and jacks. Ace high diamond. Lush. Dang it. Well, that didn't go well. Oh, we had to try it. Lose a little money. That's the way it goes. As long as you ain't no shark, we'd be grateful if you join us for a few hands. Now one was enough, sir. I thought I had him bluffed out, but he had a better hand than I thought, so. So let's go talk to the boss lady. See what she's doing over here. Just... I want to post her over here. I will, we'll save that. I'm not going to go after him yet. We may go after him in a little bit, but let's go ahead and do Bonnie's. We'll have plenty of time to do those later. Well, hello, Miss Bonnie. Come on, come on, let's go! Hey, Get him in there! Come on, come on! Hey, Miss! Hey, Miss, I got most of the horses secure and the chicken. Well, thank you, Amos, but it's the herd I'm worried about. I know, they're scattered all over the valley and beyond. The weather is coming in real fast. So what do you suggest, Amos? We leave the herd out there to be scattered by the storm and ourselves left here to die without a livelihood? Can I help? No, miss. If the men get caught out in that storm, they're gonna die. And if we lose our herd, we'll all die, you stupid man. Doesn't sound like we're left with much of a <laughs> choice then. Come on, Amos. Round up your men. Let's get the herd. Dang. I get the, get the horses and go get the herd. You don't have much time. Go! Easy now! Let's go get him before this hurricane comes in. The this tornado. guy don't look good. I'm starting to think somebody up there is conspiring against me. Are you a religious man? Not in any real sense. Sometimes I tell myself things happen for a reason. Like what brought me here was fate come a-calling. But nobody made my path but me. We all need to look for answers somewhere. Some in big old books, others in big old bottles of whiskey. Believing in some kind of divine purpose ain't gonna get me my wife and kid back. Pastors who we are, Miss McFarland. There ain't no change in that. Faith is a luxury I can't afford. We have two herds out grazing in different pastures. We'll need to merge them and bring them all back. I think we can handle that. The cows get real ornery in bad weather. It's more work, but I'll show you how to deal with them. <laughs> it's gonna be difficult to talk in this weather. Stay close. We don't want to lose each other. Not that bad yet. Guys, giddy up. Hi, yo. I haven't seen a storm like this for a while. We need to be quick. Yeah. 
Try to get up here with your cattle, folks. No running off. Where are you going, baby? You need to go back the other way. Come on. Come on, get back over here. Get on. Giddy up. Giddy up. Come on. Okay. Yeah, that's why I scare him. couple of them. Come on, get back. Hey, come on. Get over there now, come on. Let's go. Where do you think we're going? Get back over there to the rest of them. Come on guys, let's get back to the barn. Got some hay there for you. Got some good old fashioned hay. Just keep a riding. Keep a riding. Catch up to him, gal. Come on, buddy. Here we go. Yeah, get up. Oh, where are you going? Where are you going? Where do you think you're going? Oh, no, 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 no. You need to get back to the cattle. You too, buddy. Need to go too. Come on. Yeah, that's right. Got some nice grazing hay at the barn for you now. Come on, keep going. Get up there. Watch the tracks now. Come on. Into the pen. You too now. Come, Come on. on. I can't do this all by myself in this weather. What are you talking about? You always doing it all. You're riding ahead and not paying attention. You saved the herd back there. You might make a decent rancher one day. Thank you, Miss McFarland. Gee up. There we go. We got the herd. back way here.
go ahead and sleep through the rest of this night here. The storm. Hello. A nice little save here. Oh, it's still raining. So it looks like we're done with her missions for a while. Let's see if that uh, poster, wanted poster, is still up over here. Let me overtake it. Dang it. I guess I need to take them while they're up. Oh, Marshall? Black Beauty here. So now we gotta go do the Marshall's quest, so we'll head that way. Get out of town here, and then we'll use the provisions to. to quickly travel there. And yeah, I know I need to spend some time going around, but we'll do that on another. another uh, run. Get into town here, and we'll take care of the marshal for a little bit. Yeah, yeah, get over it. There we go. That's what I should have did, but that's okay. We're going to go down here and see what the question mark is first. force help you? Oh, they can't even help themselves. Please, sir. My son is missing. I need your help. If I find him, I'll bring him back to you. <laughs> oh, the hanging rocks. Let's see where that's at. It's somewhere in that area there, right? Yeah, so we'll... Hi. Hi, little one. You're a nice doggy, but I gotta go rescue a boy here. Okay. There is stuff we can loot too. I just saw that. Some grass and weeds and stuff that used to make poultices and probably some other stuff. But I forgot we could do that. We might do that too as we're going back. So we're up on the hill there, so. 
So we're gonna go back this way and take a overland pass. Someone shooting around here. There you are. Grab some of that for later. Get back here, buddy. Let's go. There's somewhere around here. That's not good. Interesting. I looked around there, didn't see him. Found a clue, but not the full clue. Okay, there's somebody shooting over here. We need to go take a look at that. That might be one of the trick shooters. side of the mountain. shooting. I can't see him yet. Okay, let's go back to town. Oh, all messed up on... Let's go talk to this guy. There's much treasure here. You want map? I retire. Here, take map. You earn it. Thanks, mister. Oh, well, there we go. We got a map to treasure. Now if we look at it. We can read it. And one is the mountain. Two is something over there. It looks like Hanging rock. Did I see the hangman's noose? The mountains are in 
to a rock. Somewhere over here, probably. Go back over to the hanging rock area. Come on. There's the hanging tree. So it's gotta be around here somewhere. that again. There's the rock with our tree with the thing on it and then I walk around here a little bit. I don't think we have to dig for it. Go ahead and get a little hunting in what were you out of the way. in this direction and take a peek. I know it's somewhere around here, just not quite sure yet. Come looking for that. It's somewhere around here. Gotta yeah, look at the clues a little better at some point. But let's get back and let's do what we originally set out to do, and which was to talk to uh, yeah. the sheriff. We did a good and bad. Sheriff, come to say hi. Hello, hello. It's Armadillo Seven Three One. What is it with these things? Hello. It's a new line. Hello, hello. Sounds fun. What's happening? I have no idea. If it's important, they'll send someone down like they did with you. Suddenly, the world is full of days. Yeah. <laughs> I remember when we first got here. We used to consider people from Dade County to be exotic. Now guys can get here from the Midwest, and they can do it in six days. Things have changed. <laughs> They've gotten away from me. Hello? I don't understand it no more, boy. Honest goodness. I'm not sure I do. <laughs> Marshal! Marshal! <coughs> Marshal! I've just been up in the canyon, spying like you said. I think I seen me a couple of them rustlers. I think it was the Baller Twins and a couple of Mexicans. They up there right now? Well, it was a group of four men rounding up Mr. Gulch's livestock, and none of them looked like any of Gulch's hands, so yes, sir, right now. That sarcasm's most unbecoming, Eli. It's going to hold you back in life, even worse than your lazy eye. 
All right, let's go. <laughs> you ride with us again, Marson? Will you help me? I will try. And it'd be my pleasure. <laughs> I came because it was made impossible for me not to. You sure are a tight lip son of a bitch, mister. I guess I am. I ain't gonna dig this hole no deeper. Well, ain't you all proud and superior? Don't forget you need us more than we need you. Bill Williamson folded you up like an empty person last time, if I remember correctly. Never down, Jonah. Listen to your boss, Jonah. There's a good boy. Otherwise, I'll put a hole in your hillbilly head and watch your tiny brain drain out. <laughs> Be honest with you, Marston. I ain't for all this government interference. Believe me, Marshal. Neither am I. I try to keep the federal boys happy. I mean, we need all the help we can get. But what does a flannel mouse city boy who's never forked a bale of hay in his life know about a state like New Austin? Nothing, I reckon. All this manifest destiny hogwash. Came in a wild land, bringing modernization and betterment to the West. Not far now. Eyes open, boys. Yep. Gotta enjoy the good old simple days. Alright, leave the horses here and follow me. Easy. Let's go. Stay alert, boys. That was your problem, Marston. Be ready, boys. We're probably gonna be outnumbered. And those bastards ain't short on firepower, neither. Let's see how many there are. If we can take them alive, good. If not, smoke the sons of bitches. Music to my ears, Marshal. You know we're gonna just smoke them all out. We parked our horses far enough back. in the camp. Yeah. 
you start to regret this yet? Okay, I gotta look around here. Might find some good stuff. Nothing else. More ammo. Got a little money, too. That's a good way to get money. Best here. Let's retry that from the checkpoint. Look out! There are them snipers! Follow me! Pop your head out. to get back up. We gotta go a long way around. This looks as good a spot as any. Gather around, listen up. Let's get as close as we can before opening fire. Come on. 
Come on! Hey, this one. Let him have it! We have to go to the house of Sam and Cat! Come on! Let's get these sons of bitches! I'm the goddamn law! For the love of God! This ain't a game! God. Come on, poke your head out. Nice shot! That bastard won't be rustling no more. Excuse me, partner. I ain't getting fresh. I think that's all of them. Fine shooting, boys. Now come on, let's untie those hostages. Uh, hello. Thanks, Marshal. We're indebted to you with our lives. Just get them cattle back safe. All right. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Well done, Mr. Marston. Yes, well done. Now, <laughs> about Williamson. I'll do what I can. You know, as you can see, this country is infested with all manner of scum. Say that again. Well, one other thing, Marston. Mr. Johnson, sir. It's Mr. Wes Dickens. He's missing. Who? Mr. Wes Dickens, the tonics merchant. He was doing town last week. Oh, the narcotic and bat piss salesman. <laughs> Cons housewives out of their money with promises of eternal youth. Yes, him, but I think you're being a little unfair. He's helped a great many of the county, and many of the townsfolk are really missing him. You hear that, Marston? We just butchered a gang of thieves, and the town is up in arms about a missing snake oil merchant. I am so glad to be serving such a wise and respectable people. Come on, Eli. Hey, you go ahead and go. I gotta go over the Newton. Okay, that helps out our fundage. All right, well, we gotta find Mr. Dickens. No one over here. Thank you, sir. He's contributing to a good, good cause here. I'm low on money and no bullets cause. Thank you kindly, sir. And what do you have in there? Oh, some money. Thank you, thank you. So happy to have your donations. What do you have in here, good sir? Yeah, more for the donations. How about a pocket watch or two? Oh, thank you, thank you. There we go. Another fine day in the Old West. So we're going to put a little camp up here. But that's been a good day. We did a few different quests. We helped out some folks. But I think that's where we're going to leave it. And next episode, we'll go after and find Mr. Wilkinson. So like always, give me that like. If you enjoyed the video, give me a subscribe if you're new to the channel. And we will see you on the next one.